This is Violet. This is one of the most sweetest, loving, outgoing kittens I've ever met. And I've met a lot of kittens. She just loves everyone. And she's just like, <laughs> she's just very inquisitive and loving and playful and headbutts. And she's flipping adorable. <laughs> Look at her face. Look at that little face on you. Look, her nose is half pink, half black. And she's got the cutest little like knee socks and I don't know, she's just adorable. Hi. And I just met her. I met her once before for a few minutes and this is the second time I've met her. She's just, what's that? She hears something. She hears it. This is a, she's at a foster home. So she hears another foster cat crying. What are you doing? Go see mama. Go see foster mama. Go ahead. Go ahead. Show them how cute you are. I love how her legs are like black in the back. Show how cute you are. No, don't go up there. She wants to go up in the, look in the window. No, no, no. Come here. <laughs> go see foster mom. So anyway, she's very affectionate. Like you can hold her and squeeze her. She loves to give really hard head bumps. She loves attention. She does not like to be alone. She's just a very loving, social kitten. She's about four months old. Um, she's just like, she's literally perfect. I don't think you could say one negative thing about this kitten. So we should love, we'd love to get her into a home with another cat or like a young cat or kitten to play with and have friends um, because she is very social and very involved with things and would be lonely if she was by herself. But she's just, oh my God, she's just so perfect. You want to play now? Or are you going to do more lovies? Are you going to do more lovies? What do you think? Can I hit me tight? And look at her profile. I don't know if you can see it. We have to tell Liz not to wear black, because you can't see. But she's got this really cute, like her nose kind of pokes out, really cute profile. So she loves to play with all her toys. <laughs> she's got a little house. Maybe she'll go in the house for us, because that's kind of cute too, in the house. What do you got going on, huh? Look at how cute. She's so adorable. I mean, you just want to pick her up and squeeze her and hold her. <laughs> she's so adorable. You go in the house too? You go in there and do cute things? Look at her. Oh my gosh. Sitting outside her little apartment. Flower shop. <laughs> her little flower shop. I'm sorry, that's her place of business. You own the flower shop, Violet? You should because your name is Violet. You should. Go see mom again. Mom. Go see mom. Oh wow, she likes that one. So you gotta have lots of toys, especially these wand toys. She loves them. And when she has a little, she's in a crate here for now. She has a little hammock that she loves. You can always buy one of those and hang them under your chair. People do that. So I think she'll just love anything. She'll just love being in a home with a family and some friends. I'm sure she'd be okay with dogs. She, as long as your dog is cat friendly, she'll definitely adapt to, I think, to anything. Because she's just so sweet. And look at that toe right there. She's got a tuxy foot. <laughs> she's just. She's got so many interesting, you can keep looking, you can look at her for hours and find something new. <laughs> She's got one black ear and one white oh, ear. Oh yeah, you're right. You're crazy. Okay, well I'm gonna wrap it up. It's getting long and I could talk about her for hours because I just love this little girl. But her name is Violet, she's four months old and um, she's at a foster home. So you can meet her here and, and just fall in love with her. Thanks for watching. Come get her.